What up, guys? Professor Snap here, coming at you with pickups number six. Um, first off, before I get into it, um, shout out to Team Vintage Snap. Um, yeah, I don't know. I guess we're adding a bunch more people, so I don't really know you guys, but the originals, the Iceman, Snapback Streets, DP the Truth, and myself. The originals, um, I don't know the new guys. I guess we're adding some more people, so, you know, welcome. Um, yeah, so shout out to them. Um, here's my pickups for the week. Um, seems like I'll be doing these things every Tuesday, so, um, I guess I'll do these every Tuesday, but, um, uh, I want to let you guys know that, um, I'm actually going to start slowing down on my pickups. Um, I didn't buy too much, like, clothing-wise this time. Um, I'm just trying to save some money and not buy so much stuff, so, uh, but I still got a decent amount of stuff over the week. This is all stuff I've gotten over like exactly a week from last Tuesday. So um yeah, let's get into it. Alright, so you know Coca-Cola bed edition, like always on my pickups. But uh yeah, first thing, I got some skateboards. Um you guys probably don't know this, but um I'm actually a skateboarder too. I skate. So um I was happy to find these and this is like if any of you guys know anything about like skateboarding like you know here's a um I think this is a zero deck I think these are both zero decks. This is either a mystery deck or a zero deck, but I guess I'll go over it for you guys that don't or that know what I'm talking about. Um, so some thunder trucks and then independent trucks. I actually needed new trucks and stuff, so this was you know cheap, five bucks for each of these, which is good. So yeah, it's my skateboards. I figured I'd show you guys that. All right, so this time I started looking um, for duffel bags, actually like vintage duffel bags, and um, this is, here, I'll show you the first one I got. This is, I think, is so dope. Look at this. Colorado Rockies on the side. Colorado Rockies right here. Purple duffel bag. So, um, you know, you'll see me at the store. I'm actually, since I've been going this last week, I've been looking at all the bags. And um, I found another one. I just forgot to grab it. Um, to go back and grab it. But, um, yeah. So this is the first one, Colorado Rockies. Pretty dope. I like it. And the next one's a Nike, like teal. I love the black and teal. See, it's just the Nike right here and then a little bag. So instead of rocking backpacks, I'm going to be rocking these duffel bags for my school, for school bags and all that stuff. I just think they look cool when you, like, put them on the strap. But then it's not like a purse. It's like a G purse kind of thing. Yeah, purse for Gs. <laughs> Alright, uh, next here we'll go to the clothing. I just got two jackets. I told you I'm trying to cut down. Um, my pickups from now on probably won't be as big as they have been. Um, so, yeah, just like a, this is like a Letterman, just gray, like a Letterman jacket. Really nice. Not too much to talk about. Um, this windbreaker, I just couldn't pass up. I just thought it was so dope. You know, Nike right here. I, this is what got me. See the zippers right here? It says Nike right there when you put it up, the black and the white. And there's something on the sleeve. I think this is supposed to be for um, the Olympics, like 96 Olympics and stuff. Some kind of promotion between them. But yeah, pretty dope. Pretty happy about this. So yeah, that's that. Um, we'll go to these. Um, I actually bought these at Walmart. And then I painted, or I, I got Sharpie. And now they're uh, Vans looking things. I've actually been getting a lot of compliments on these. So I figured I'd show you guys and see if you guys like them. You know, comment and see if, tell me if you guys like it. Um, I just did blue and orange. I can really do whatever color I want. But yeah, I picked these up at Walmart for like 10 bucks, And then some Sharpies for like 3 bucks, And then colored them, drew, drew them on. See that? The laces, the vans. A little dirty. You know, I've been wearing them. So yeah, that's that. Um, let's go to the hard hats before we get to the hats. Um, new swag hats, you know, shout out to Iceman. Um, I've been getting these, grabbing these just because I see them. Um, I actually even haven't grabbed them all. This is just the, the ones that I saw that I wanted. There was a lot more, but, um, you know, I think it'd be cool to have every team, so I'll go through here. So here we got a, you know, blue Toronto. Um, my girlfriend's from Canada, so I kind of just rep Canada just because, just to make her happy. <laughs> so, yeah. Toronto, you know, San Diego, or San Diego Padres, um, nothing on the back, just all blue, um, Boston, Red Sox, 
pretty dope. Um, Diamondbacks, Arizona Diamondbacks, 66 on the back. I don't know who that is. I don't watch baseball too much, to be honest with you. Baseball bores me. All right, now for the hats. I got um, five snapbacks and two fitteds. But, um, yeah, we'll do the fitteds first, I guess. Sorry. So, yeah, it's just a San Francisco, you know. Um, I, I mainly got it just because it's, a, because it's San Francisco. And, um, yeah, white underbrim. I, um, it's kind of funny, actually, because this last like couple weeks, I've been running across a lot of fitteds, like a lot of fitteds. So, um, more than, like, last year, like any year before, but... <laughs> Guess snapbacks are just in, so everyone's getting rid of their fitteds. So, you know, while they get rid of theirs, I'm going to cop all theirs. So, yeah, and the next is the Texas Ranger. Green. New Era. I think this is, like, one of the old original New Eras, like, before they made it, like, the true, like, with the logo on the side. So this is probably vintage, older New Era, like, probably early 2000s. So, yeah, pretty dope. I found a lot of hats, but the problem with fitted is when you find them is sometimes they just don't fit. So, um, yeah, let's go with the snapbacks now. So, first is an Atlanta Braves snapback. You know, not too plain. I actually have this hat already. So, um, I bought this to, you know, help you guys out. Um, sell this. So, yeah, 10 bucks ship for this if you guys want it. Pretty clean, really nice. Outdoor cap, if you guys care about the brand uh, we'll do the next one uh, I found no we'll do yeah this Tennessee um, yeah pretty dope Tostitos Fiesta Bowl it's a logo athletic if you guys want to see still has the cardboard in it logo athletic green under brim never worn yeah pretty cool um, now we'll get to my I found you two Utah Jazz ones um, here's another Utah Jazz one. You'll see this in my restoration video that I'll put up later this sometime this week. Um, this thing was like a pancake, and there was writing right here. You can still see it, but definitely not as bad as what it used to be. So, yeah, this is, I restored it. Um, this one was pretty bad, so, I mean, it's still got a couple wrinkles, but it looks a lot better than what it used to be, and it's wearable now. So, yeah, it's pretty dope. Green underbrim. You know, I like my Jazz. Um, I actually had another hat like this, and I ruined it trying to fix it. <laughs> it was one of my first hats, and it was the black and the the um, purple with the purple snap, just like this. But I had a gray underbrim, and it was a logo seven. But this one I like a lot better actually because it's a little, it's nicer. It's not as faded. The green underbrim's dope. Um, it's wool. The other one was like the acrylic stuff. So I was happy to find this hat because I had to throw that other one hat out. It was basically the first, yeah, basically the first snapback I ever got a few years ago was this snapback, just gray underbrim and logo seven. But so I was sad that I had to throw it away. But now I'm glad that I got, you know, the same style back. So yeah, happy about that. And last is a brand new with tags, Super Bowl champions, uh, Super Bowl. 32 Broncos snapback with tags logo athletic see the tag see the tag Super Bowl in the back never been worn logo athletic right there gray under brim you know NFL license all that um, you know I bought this to sell so if you guys want to buy this hit me up um, I already have two other Broncos hats so I really don't need another Broncos hat in my collection and um, I don't wear championship hats unless it's like a team I like or it's my team. Basically, if it's my team. And Broncos aren't really my team, so I'm not going to rep a champion's hat. So, yeah, hit me up. I'm thinking, you know, 30 shipped, um, which is pretty good. It's brand new with tags. So, hit me up, yeah. Help a brother out. So, yeah, that's all my stuff. Right there, right there. All on the floor, just like that. So, um... Yeah, that's my pickups number six, I think. Uh, shout out to TVS, Team Vintage Snap. All you guys, uh, rate, comment, subscribe. I got a restoration video coming today, or uh, sometime this week. So, yeah, be on the lookout for that. Uh, I'll probably have a rant video because there's something I want to talk about. Um, we'll see how that goes over. So, yeah, peace. I'll see you next time.